the first step in creating your barcodes will be verifying that your data for your uh, items is uh, correct and up to date. So the information needed is your inventory number, if you're using inventory numbers, the description, and the asking price. Now my screen's set up to show those. If you don't see one of those columns, you can modify the columns by clicking columns, and you can select and deselect the various um, customized columns here. Again, asking price, description, inventory number are the important attributes for the barcode scanning. Once you can see those, verify that they're correct, and you can always modify those if need be. Um, for example, this first item here, if I want to change the asking price to 175, you can do that by just clicking, changing, and then click away. It'll update um, that item. Now you're ready to print your barcodes. To do that, you'll simply go over to the checkboxes in front of the items you would like to print barcodes for, and you'll click the checkboxes for those items. Once you click this checkbox, you'll notice you'll have some options with four items selected. On the drop down there, you can print barcodes. So we'll go ahead and click that. And if you have multiple boosts paired to your Sandpaper account, you'll be able to select those boosts here. You'll want that consigner code or that, that booth number um, for the store you're going to be selling the items in to be correct. In this case, we just have one. So um, SPD it is for our booth number. Um, for the label sizes, for standard home uh, inkjet printers, we recommend a four by one. If you have a high quality um, laser printer, the two and five eighths by one will give you a smaller uh, label. But since we'll be using just a standard inkjet printer, we're gonna use a four by one, and we'll go ahead and print the labels. And here you go, these are your labels. You'll go ahead and put your uh, uh, sheet of um, labels in the printer, and then we can print it. You can stick these barcodes on your items, and uh, the store will be able to scan them um, without having to enter any uh, hand enter any data.